All right, so you know that ChatGPT is so famous around the world and even in Vietnam. So I decided to figure out what is ChatGPT and how it can help my work or stuff like that. So, but I think it is easier to ask itself because you know it is an artificial intelligence so it can answer my question. So I just make a video asking ChatGPT, what is ChatGPT and its capability? And here's the answer, okay? I am ChatGPT, a large language model developed by OpenAI. I can answer questions on a wide range of topics, from questions about everyday life to questions about science and technology. No, I am not a human. I am an artificial intelligence language model created by OpenAI. I use advanced deep learning algorithms to generate responses to questions based on the patterns in the text I was trained on. During my training, I was exposed to a diverse range of texts, such as books, articles, and websites, so I have a broad understanding of many topics. When I receive a question, I use this understanding to generate a response that I think best answers the question. I was trained on a diverse range of texts from the internet, including websites, books, and articles. The data used to train me was gathered from the public domain and covers a wide range of topics and styles of writing. OpenAI curated this data to ensure that it was high quality and suitable for training a language model like me. The data was then pre-processed and fed into my training algorithms to enable me to learn how to generate human-like text. The websites, books, and articles used to train me were gathered from the public domain and come from a variety of sources. Some of the data was obtained from publicly accessible websites and online repositories, while other data was obtained from digitized books and articles. OpenAI used automated methods to crawl the web and gather this data, and then filtered it to ensure that it was high quality and suitable for training a language model like me. The final training dataset consisted of billions of words, taken from a wide range of sources and covering a diverse range of topics and styles of writing. The data used to train me was gathered from the public domain, which means that it is publicly available and not subject to copyright restrictions. However, the specific sources of the data are not publicly disclosed by OpenAI. Additionally, while the raw data may not be subject to copyright, the specific selection and pre-processing of the data by OpenAI may be protected by copyright or other intellectual property rights. As an AI language model, I strive to provide accurate and reliable information. However, I am not perfect and there may be times when my responses are incorrect or outdated. It's always a good idea to verify information from multiple sources before making important decisions. As an AI language model, I do not have the ability to verify the truthfulness of information. I can provide information and answer questions based on the patterns in the text I was trained on, but I cannot independently determine the accuracy or truthfulness of that information. It's always a good idea to verify information from multiple credible sources and consider the context in which it was presented before making any decisions or conclusions. I was trained using a deep learning technique called transformer-based neural language modeling. This involves feeding the model large amounts of text data and using that data to update the model's parameters so that it can generate text that is similar to the input data. The goal of the training is to have the model learn the patterns and structures in the text, so that it can generate text that is grammatically correct semantically meaningful, and resembles human writing. The training process involves using a large neural network architecture that consists of multiple layers of interconnected nodes. Each layer of the network processes the input data and passes it on to the next layer, allowing the model to learn increasingly complex patterns in the data. The parameters of the model are updated using an optimization algorithm, such as stochastic gradient descent which adjusts the weights of the connections between the nodes based on the error between the model's generated text and the actual target text. The training process is iterative, with the model being trained on large amounts of data over many epochs until it reaches a performance threshold. Sure. Here are some of my capabilities. 1. Text completion and generation. 2. Text-based question answering. 3. Conversational AI. 4. Sentiment analysis. 5. Text summarization. 6. Text classification. 7. Named entity recognition. 8. Part of speech tagging. 9. Translation. 10. Text to speech and speech to text. Note that these are some of my capabilities and they may vary based on the specific model and its training data. I'm sorry, I'm a text based model and do not have the capability to perform a voiceover. I apologize for the confusion. As a language model, I do not have the ability to perform text-to-speech myself. However, the technology for text-to-speech exists and there are many tools and services that can convert text input into speech output. Certainly. 
Goodbye to all the viewers who have watched this video until now. I hope I was able to provide you with helpful information. Have a great day!